welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. I have a special delivery. This happens to be one of my subscription boxes and Bow Candy is like a company that will send you, I think it's like 15 or $20 every month, a box of international food, snacks, and candy. And since this is my first ever Bow Candy box opening, I really have no clue what's inside of here. So what do you guys see? We open it up and see what we get. Let's do it. So exciting! I love opening up these surprise boxes, whether they have makeup or candy. And here we go. Ooh. When you sign up for this at bowcandy.com, I think you can either sign up for snacks and candy or just plain old candy. I think I signed up for both. The time to waste. Let's see what's in this box of goodies. So the first one, hmm. Mixed gummy candy. It looks like there's some either Chinese or Japanese writing. And it says apple, muscat, <laughs> musket. What is that? I don't know. And grape. I guess they're like, ooh, product of Japan. They are gummy candies. I've never seen these before. Next out of my box of treats, what do we have? Ooh. <laughs> Definitely not candy. What do we have? <gasps> this is the craziest thing ever. When I signed up for this, I had no clue we'd be getting some jerky in here. It is Katie's Premium Jerky and Snacks. Incredibly tender, intense flavor. Ooh, I love a good beef jerky. We gotta try that. Boop. After seeing that, really anything can pop out of this little box. So what is this? Ooh, popcorn. Kettle Delicious Mini Popcorn. Gluten-free, whole grain, and a small batch. <laughs> I thought I was reading it wrong. I guess it's little tiny kernels of popcorn. Ooh, that's weird. Popcorn. gotta try it. Ooh, there's still tons more. What is this? Mini Cola. Oh, how super duper cute. It looks like a little can of Coke. Maybe it's candy. I don't even know what this is. We get a bag, it looks like some kind of stubby flips. Uh, <laughs> what is this? I don't think this is an American stack. It's called Stilby or Stobby Flips. Weird. It says Macedonia Super Brands. It's made with peanuts and Vitaminka. I don't know, looking at this, they look like little cheese puffs or cheese doodles made with peanuts. Maybe they have like a peanutty flavor. We will test those. Are you kidding me? We get a huge can of some kind of a drink. Looks like a can of Coca-Cola. It says Manzanita Sol. This is weird. I've never seen one of these. Manzana, I guess that's an apple flavor. Maybe this is like a drink from Mexico. Look, yes it is. There is such a mix of stuff in here. I cannot even take it. Candy, drink, chips, jerky. What is this one? Oh, weirdest little thing ever, but so super adorable at the same time. We get a Thomas the Tank Engine. This looks like a pack of gum. <laughs> and maybe it's like grape flavored. That is so cute. You can believe it or not, there is still stuff in here. This box is like endless. So we get this. You guys are gonna like this. I couldn't tell what it was. It kind of looked like little lifesaver candies. Whistle candy. Unbelievable, what is that? Two more things at the bottom. Ooh, there's three more things. <laughs> so this one here is called Pure Gummy. Juicy Lemon Gummy. Interesting. We get this little one. It's called Lacquerol Bonbons. Ooh, little bonbons. Ooh, they're peppermint flavored. Final one. What could it be? Candy. Not too sure what this is. The package is so crazy colorful. It looks really good. And it kind of feels like Pop Rock. So there it is, all the things we're gonna test out from the Bow Candy Box. And I have to say, this is the first time I'm opening. I am not disappointed. There's such a mix of crazy things in here. I don't think I've tasted any one of them. Let's do this. Looks like we're starting with the Stobby Flips. Ooh, these kind of 
of look really good. They look like they're kind of peanut flavored cheese doodles. I'm not too sure which country they're from. It doesn't say. Can't wait to try them. Oh, they smell so good. I could smell it from here. Ooh, these look delicious actually. I wasn't too sure, but now that I'm seeing them, they look like a peanut flavored cheese doodle. Mmm, oof! They are so, so, so good. Best way to describe these is a super crunchy, like a rice cake or corn puff. And it's got all of this peanutty powder on there. Mm, it's delicious. I've never had anything like it. Gotta get more of these. Move in from those peanutty doodles to Katie's Original Beef Jerky. Some people love jerky, some don't. I definitely love it. I don't eat it all the time, but if I see it in the store, sometimes I'll grab it. It just has the yummiest kind of salty, chewy texture. And this one has incredibly intense flavor. Ooh, I wonder if it's spicy. When you look at this, it's not the most appetizing thing. It looks kind of scary. But don't let it fool you. The flavor is so awesome. I've never tried this brand before. Mmm. Smells really, really strong. Kind of like a smoky scent. Like a hickory barbecue. Oh, it looks gross. I'm not going to lie. It looks super gross. Mmm. Delicious. That is so, so good. I was so hungry right now and that just did it. If you guys have never had beef jerky, it's kind of like this smoky, dried out meat. It's hard. It kind of looks like a dog rawhide, like a dog bone. But it is so salty and tasty. I could literally eat this whole entire pack. Ew, but it's so greasy. <laughs> After trying this, I really love it. But I have to say, I have had much better beef jerky. This wasn't the tastiest, tastiest. It had a good flavor but I've definitely had better. Boop. Switching it from a little meat snack to some candy. Oh, look at this mini cola. It is in like the cutest container ever. And I'm not sure if it's candy, but it sounds like it. What else could be in there? Like maybe a little sweet tart. How do you open this thing? Oh, found it. There's like this little piece. You just pull it out. And there you go. Whoop. Here are these little pellets and just smelling them, <laughs> they smell like Coca-Cola. And I have had these before, not this brand, but these little fizzy soda candies. Mm. These things are unbelievable. As soon as you take a bite, it feels like you just took a sip of soda. It's got the fizz and like that carbonated flavor of Coke or Pepsi. Cutest little container. <laughs> I really, really love these. Just had to take some water. I have such a mix of taste on my mouth right now. I had to cleanse my palate. Get ready for this one. Ooh, it's called Pure Gummy Juicy Lemon Gummy. Such a cute package. It looks really fresh, like lemonade. And it is a product of Japan. Ooh. I wonder if they're going to be super sour or sweet. Like a little heart sheeps. Ooh, they have a kick to them. Oh, these are delicious. I have to see when I first saw this, I wasn't so excited because I usually don't go for lemon flavor. I like cherry and strawberry, but these are so, so good. They're so refreshing. They are so, so sour and sweet, and I love them. <laughs> it's not something I ever would have bought on my own. They are really good. Here's the bow candy box is good because they send you things that you normally wouldn't try. And now I know that I like these. <laughs> so maybe I'll go for some lemon candy once in a while. It's got a whole bunch of this sweet and sour sugar. Look what just appeared, the pip corn. <laughs> Not the popcorn, our little pippy corn. This is so cute and I'm loving this package. It looks like an old fashioned, like a brown paper bag really is the craziest material. Ooh, it's got a little story on the back. It says, a brother and sister duo. Find some mini kernels and have an idea. Get a pot, 
attract loyal Pip fans at food markets and get a bigger pop. Ooh, interesting. So I guess the whole thing with this is it's like this tiny corn because it came from these little kernels. I don't know. We gotta try it. OMG. <laughs> Look at this, you guys. It is tiny. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but it's like a quarter of the size of a regular popcorn. these little tiny kernels. I have to say I love kettle corn, but I do prefer the regular bigger popcorn better than these. These aren't as crunchy or fluffy. I don't know, it's like they're missing something. <laughs> so I don't think pip corn is really for me. I don't think I'd buy it again, but it was super fun to try. Guess with this, I really don't even see the point. I mean, if you're gonna eat popcorn, you might as well eat a big, fluffy piece of popcorn. Why would you want this little thing here? I don't know, not for me. Ooh, we got a candy. <laughs> We're doing a snack and then a candy, it's like a pattern. This looks like it's by Mycin, I guess it's a company. And I'm not even sure what it is. I can't read what it says. But if I had seen this in a regular store, I definitely would have bought it. <laughs> because it's just like right up my alley. It looks so cool. Gotta open it. My scissors! Okay, so this definitely does look like a popping candy. I don't know, let's see. Yep, looks like Pop Rocks. Ooh, but it's got something in there. It kind of looks like those little soda candies. They're like these little white pellets. Huge purple Pop Rocks. Let's see, I'm a little scared of these. Ah! Whoa. <laughs> I have to say, these things are super scary and they really put Pop Rocks to shame. There are huge, cracking, exploding rocks. Oh man, they're really good. And then in between those super huge like exploding candies, you get these little white sweet pellets. They kind of taste like sweet tarts. Yeah, this is so, so different. But I have to say, so far it's my favorite thing we've opened. I'm starting to get a little thirsty. I better take a drink of the Manzanita Soul. <laughs> this is like the cutest can ever. If you look at it quick, it looks like soda, and I love it's got that little apple on there. It says product of Mexico. Crack it open and try it. Here it goes. And I have to say, I'm kind of a picky person with my drinks. I don't like Red Bull or any of those energy drinks. I only like either like seltzer water or regular Coke or Pepsi. So I don't think I would have ever bought this on my own. Ah, gotta try it. It either tastes like apple juice with tons and tons of like sparkling water in it, or the only way I can really describe it is as apple soda. It's kind of like a yellowish color. Really, really tasty. I gotta find more of these. <laughs> bonbons! I have never tried a bonbon before. These are called lacquerol bonbons. They are a product of Sweden. Ooh, we get something from Sweden. And it says peppermint. So I'm not sure if these are like chocolate kind of mints or just like Tic Tacs. Let's see. Time to check these out. What are they? Ooh. These actually look like jelly beans. <laughs> I had a feeling maybe they were like chocolate inside. But I think there's some kind of these jelly bean mints. Let me try. Ugh, ew! I do not like these. First of all, I'm not the biggest fan of peppermint. I do like uh, those peppermint York patties, so I was hoping for some chocolate and peppermint stuff, but no, it's just like a really super hard jelly bean with a huge minty flavor. Almost kind of tastes like toothpaste. I just do not like these bonbons. Yeah. But I think I'm gonna like this one. How could you not like it? Look at this cute package. It's got Thomas the Train. And at first I thought it was gum, but when I flipped it, it is some soft candy. <laughs> it's a product of Japan. The Japanese candies really are the cutest. They have the cutest little pictures and characters. And it's gonna be great. 
<laughs> Look at this, you guys. So I saw that it was soft candy, not gum. So I'm thinking it's gonna be like these little chewy cubes. But look at this, when you open it, it's got these little gum sticks. <laughs> it's too, too cute for words. It's like a green one. You get a yellow, little number one engine. We get Connor. Look at this one, I love how they're all different pictures on there. When I see this kind of shape and wrapping, I mean, all I could think of is gum. So <laughs> maybe it's some kind of a taffy candy. I don't get it. No, nope, it's not candy for sure. This is bubble gum. This is a piece of the yummiest, sweet and kind of soury grape flavor. It's gum and it's so super adorable. Love this one too. Switching in from the cutesy Thomas gum to some amazing chorus whistle candy. What is this? I've never seen anything like this in a candy store before. I think this is Japanese too, I'm not sure. Ooh, product of Japan. Oh, look at those. It's got this little box here. I'm not sure what's in there. I think it's strawberry flavored. Gotta pop this out of here. So I see these things, they're super hard, kind of in the shape of like a lifesaver, and they feel like a sweet tart. They don't have the best taste, they're not, they kind of taste like chalky. Maybe you just like blow into the center. Oh yeah, I get it. It is like a little whistle. Mm, doesn't have the best taste, kind of tastes like a sweet tart. But then we get this. I cannot take the cuteness with this. Look at this tiny little box. I have no clue what's supposed to be in here. Maybe it's like more candy. See, what is it? We got, it looks like a llama. <laughs> it looks like a little llama paper clip. So weird. I don't know, I guess it's kind of cute because it came out of here. All I could think is with the whistle candy, you get a little surprise toy. I don't know, I like it. I like the whole thing. Boop. Uh, I have so many different flavors going in my mouth right now. I don't think the beef jerky mixes well with the gum and the sugary stuff, but whatever, we gotta test it out. So, can you believe it? We are on to the final treat that we're gonna taste. And I just have so many flavors going right now. I have the jerky, the apple soda, candy. My tongue is it's going crazy right now. So the final one is this one. It's called Fruits Mix Gummy Candy. And I'm a little confused because of this one. I don't know what musket, muscat, is that a flavor? I don't even know. It says, we have assorted three types of fruits. Flavor most popular in Japan. Enjoy our tasty and juicy Kasagai gummy candy. Well, we're about to find out. Let's see what it is. It's funny because the second, these are all individually wrapped, but the second I like threw them out of the bag, it smells amazing. Kind of smells like Laffy Taffy. So we get this one here, apple flavored. Oh, they are like gummies. I thought maybe they were hard candies. Super squish. Unbelievable. This tastes just like this apple soda. It's got the same taste. It's kind of like fizzy and carbonated. Mm. It's not something I usually would like, but I like it. Moving on to that muscat flavor. And I guess muscat is grape because it's got these little green grapes on there. That's what it must be. It is like a light green color. It's got some sugar powder on there. Weird! This is like I bit into a green grape. That's what it looks and tastes like. Doesn't that look like a grape? It's so fresh and sweet. I just don't know how they got that flavor. It's not my favorite, favorite taste in the world, but it's just so weird. I love it. And the final one looks like some purple grapes. Probably I'm gonna like this one the best. These are really, really juicy. Pure grape juice, that's what it tastes like. The green grape tasted like a real piece of fruit. 
This one tastes like a sweet, syrupy grape juice. Not crazy about it, but it's got such an intense flavor. It's really good. So at the end of it, I give this September Bow Candy Box an A+. I think this is the craziest mix of things ever. You get some candy, you get some snacks, even drinks, and some of them I didn't like, but as a whole, they were super, super good. And after the taste test, I have to say my least, least favorite thing were these. <laughs> these little minty bonbons. They were gross. They tasted like mouthwash or toothpaste. I thought the cutest, cutest thing in here was this Thomas gum. <laughs> You'd never see that in a store here. And I just thought it was just like the cutest little thing. If I had to pick a favorite in this whole entire bunch here, I would go for these. These Pop Rocks were amazing. They were so sweet. They were so poppy. They were like the best exploding candy ever. I love these. Cannot wait for my October Bow Candy Box. And if you want to see super fun videos just like this, you can click this big yellow circle here with the bubble gum machine in it and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day. Bye.